All right, welcome back to space. Uh, we're gonna kill things with lasers. Oh, yeah, we just conquered this planet. It was the the last planet. It was the home world of. I forget what it w they were. They were uh. They were zealots. Uh. They were the not conkelders. Yeah, the con yeah we were at war with the conkelders and whoever these guys were. I forgot who they were now. Will it tell me? Yeah, the rogue. They're not called Rokon. The Staraxin. That is that who it was? That doesn't sound right. I guess it was. Pip, can you wait like a week? <laughs> oh, I only got 11, 26 bits. <laughs> uh, no bits for me, sir. We are the gods. Come on, it's been months since I was boss. Months? Really? Months? I don't think months. Okay, anyway. Uh... So now that we've obliterated them, we can't allow these guys to have a single colony, so we must destroy this colony instantly. Alright, that's what we're doing. We're, we're currently trying to obliterate these guys because we hate them. Sorry, power playthrough of Baldur's Gate because my last playthrough of No One Can Die mode. Haha, <laughs> interesting. Boom. 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 Goodbye. Thank you for your money! Bye! Month Pip the Liar! Let Pip be boss dot com! Now that's the biggest virus I've ever seen! Then at max a month. Yeah, maybe a month. Maybe. Okay, so now that we did that, so what is our goal right now? We're currently at that level for badges. Greetings, Rokon Empire. Greetings, myself. Oh, my homeworld is buying yellow for a lot. Um, what colonies do we have right now? Do we we have this pink one that doesn't have anything on it? We have this green one that doesn't have anything on it yet, or does it? I guess I don't know. I don't remember. I don't think we've built up this planet yet. No, we have not. I know there. I thought we had one planet that had yellow spice that it actually can be built on, like it is actually generating spice. I don't remember. I'll look, I'll explore my own worlds in a minute. N hashtag never let Pip be boss. Here we have the Healthian race in the Sparp Sparpedia. That's a very that's. Oh, I left and came back and already had another one. Um, that doesn't sound familiar, but there's literally billions of creatures that have been made over the years that this game has been released. So I don't think it's too weird that I don't know which one you're thinking of. Don't let that be trending. <laughs> hey, if any, if that became trending, I'd be impressed. But yeah, no, it's not gonna happen. Hey, blue spice guys, do you guys want to buy pink? I got lots of pink. Yeah, twelve thousand. Yeah, look at we're we're making bank now that we got that. We're gonna make so much stuff. Um, so what can we buy right now? I can buy mega. I can't afford that, no matter what. Uh, I don't. Mini pulse sucks. I don't want to buy that. Uh, energy storage. I'd like to buy that, but maybe someone else can sell it for cheaper. Does do my allies sell it? Billions. Whoa. Maybe maybe not billions. These guys look like they have a uh, five thousand. That's all right, I guess. I'll get more. Um, they do not sell energy storage. They sell these though. I might want to buy one of those. Uh. What do my other friends sell? I currently have two friends. These guys and these gr these guys. The the pink empire and the green empire. Other which are traders and shamans. If that was trending, this stream would have ma massive problem population boost. Yeah. Okay, what do you guys sell? You guys sell the same thing for the same price. Uh, that's really it. You guys sell colonies for cheaper. Okay, I'll buy a cloud accumulator. Um, there was a planet that I had that I wanted to build up. Is that the was it the purple one? Where was the my purple planet? It was on this system. This one right down here. My purple planet. What? Th this needs atmosphere and cold, right? Yes. Okay, we got this. We're going to use an ice storm. 
Versus an Ice Storm, and while that's going, we're gonna we're gonna use this a Cloud Accumulator. The Cloud Accumulator basically is infinite, increased atmosphere. You can use it for all time. Unlike these are like one uh, up till now, we've had these one-time use items. Um, as long as you have energy, you can use these. So it kind of drains your energy rather quickly, but we'll see how much that got. If it wasn't enough, I will go back. I will go recharge energy, come back, and yeah, leave and come back. And increase the atmosphere further. I think it, I don't think it's I don't think it was enough. Now that I'm looking at it, it's so close. It's like really, really close. It's like super close. Uh, is he gonna move any further? I don't think so. Okay. And we're being attacked by pirates. <laughs> Oh, well, welcome back to Hard Mode, everybody, where we get hacked by pirates every, like, five seconds. Oh, that one, of course. One of my trade route ones. The Green Empire of Terminator Pacifists. There's a treasure on my moon? How is there a treasure on my moon? Remember our cube moon? Our cube moon. How did something appear on my cube moon without me knowing? Oh, it's an art tool. Okay, that's why. Art tools can just appear for no reason. I can now make the sea. I can now make water pink. With that, if you talk about the Mephitian race, I don't know how my answer to that question would be any different than my previous one. You're asking about a single creature created on the Sporpedia. That's. I don't know how. I don't think there's a single creature, unless it's like based off of something that already exists, like a Pokemon or something that I can list off the top of my head as something that exists that I really like. You know what I mean? Okay, Cloud Accumulator, let's just keep making this go up until it's good. Also, if you don't stabilize the, stabilize it with plants and animals, it will re slowly revert back to what it was before you changed the atmosphere and temperature. So. Perfect. Okay, have a small plant. Uh, take my small plant back. Have a... Well, that was a different small plant. There's a large plant. And where's medium plant? Here's medium plant. And we need have a have a, one herbivore, another herbivore. Bring it back up so we don't lose them, and a carnivore. Boop. I can officially build stuff on my purple spice planet. That is a very good thing. Hold on, is the game gonna lock up? Oh, that was a close one. The game went all, pretty much almost lo locked up. So that is a temporary ice storm lower the temperature of the planet when the temperature issues are caused by proximity to the sun. <laughs> I don't want to answer that question. <laughs> You're asking a real-life science question in the world of Spore, a science fiction game. And again, it, it low... It, for some reason, it is, whenever I'm a it's asking me to build a factory, it lists this. The most recent factory I've built at the very bottom of my list of factories for order of when they were built. So whatever. And I don't have enough to build entertainment, so this plan I might riot. Oh darn. Game logic! Never ask! Never ask! Never question! You've been plundered by pirates. They have stolen some of your spice. Oh no! Some of my spice? Just some. Some of my spice that constantly regenerates. Yeah, I don't think it's a big deal. Okay, let's recharge. Goodbye. Now let's collect more stuff. I don't I don't have it collected over from over here in a while. This red what this red this, this is the red red spice plant. It's not that interesting. Do I only have red right now? I only have red right now. Okay, I gotta collect more. I can't help it. I only just now got the notification on my phone that you're streaming. Sounds about right. At least you got it at some point. Have I colonized this green planet yet? Yes. Like, I mean, obviously I've colonized it, because I am I have a building on it. I mean, it, have I built it up to the point where it actually collects spice? And yes, I have. So uh, now, I, now I, I have enough to build entertainment on that purple planet. Let's do that before they riot. We demand entertainment! <coughs> hey, yo! Hey, welcome! Like I even need it anymore. <laughs> exactly! Exactly. Where's the, where's the thing? I, where's my colony? Here it is. 
My colony was hiding from me. All right, this time we're just gonna build we're, this aircraft runway. Is their entertainment? Hope you guys like it. <laughs> That's their entertainment. Air, an aircraft runway. I don't know how it's their entertainment, but it is. Uh, save the game because it could lock up any time. Is working in a factory not entertainment enough? <laughs> exactly. Oh hey, a single blue spice. Thanks. How much is our pink planet? That we j conquered. Have the, how much has that generated since we since for like the last ten minutes? Sixteen. Sixteen. Oh my God, guys, we're gonna make so much money. We're gonna sell all this, sell this. We're gonna, we're gonna make it a thousand. Um. So who wants to buy this pink spice? Does so um. Am I? I think I have something from this yellow planet coming in, right? Oh, that's who I got stole. I who uh, who ro that's the planet that got robbed. Okay, there's nothing waiting there for me because it got robbed. Oh darn! That planet is in fact a money-making machine. Yep, it is. Do you guys want to buy some pink spice? For no, you don't. Okay. Why do I even have that planet? Like I already have a green planet. It's way over here and it's actually built up. I I feel like that one's a little unnecessary, but whatever. Does my homeworld want to buy some pink spice? No. No one wants to buy pink spice. That's okay. But uh, I do want to buy... I want to buy something. Oh, and they, those guys are angry with me because I didn't give them money. So we're pro we'll probably kill them eventually, too. They're just zealots. Would you guys like to buy some pink spice? Twenty-four thousand each. Boom. Money. Instant money. Uh. While we're here, we're gonna buy the cloud vacuum, the opposite of the cloud accumulator. That makes now I can infinitely decrease the atmosphere. Um. Oh wait, I didn't even sell all the ones I had. <laughs> nice. Okay. Now I'll buy this. An uh, upgraded auto blaster. Da da da. And I got a badge. They are, they are zealous that you are a big empire. Ha 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 ha. Yes. Hashtag spice raid. That planet... Yeah. Mm. How much... Oh, oh, I gotta recharge. Transmitter from a colony. Let me guess. More pirates? Under attack. Oh, this time they're actually under attack from pirates. Okay, that's... That's worse. That's a little worse. Because... Yeah. Is that they could actually destroy this, destroy the things there. Plunder, they could just steal our stuff that, you know, infin infinitely regenerates. Pink ever buying pink spice. Makes sense. Was that a pink planet? Oh, they're, they're the pink empire. I get because that's their color on the map. Okay, I understand now. Bang, bang, goodbye. Now, will we have both a better proton missile and a better... Auto blaster, so these guys should not be that hard to kill anymore. At least these level one pirates. Pirates are the weakest enemies you ever fight. Um, then there's, you know, I, I've explained the star system of other empires where if they have a higher star, their ships have more HP and do more damage. Uh, it goes from one to five. And then there's the Groks. And they, ha they, are, they are stronger than even a level five empire. Uh, well, anyway, with that out of the way, that, with that, those pirates just carrying around a whole bunch of money are out of the way. Is that all there, is that, was only, did only one drop it? Okay, by a whole bunch of money, I mean just 8,000. Got a dire flag somehow. Oh, hey, you didn't give me your yellow, the yellow spice. I think my home world was buying yellow spice for a lot. I should go, I should go sell it to there unless they've changed their mind. Let me guess, you want more money. Yeah, screw you. They just declared war on us because we 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 de uh, we. Oh wow! I unlocked a new bomb because I started more lots of wars. <laughs> nice. I'm really happy that I did a, that that happened. Um, I was definitely saying something before all that, but I forgot what it was. How much is the pink um, pink planet? Oh, uh, that's the purple planet. Wrong planet. Where's my pink planet? Over here. This one should be, like, highlighted really boldly so I can see it any, at every time. Ten more. Uh, you guys are buying both red and yellow for a decent amount. 
There you go. Started three wars. Started! Yeah, I'm the one who started the war! Yeah, me! I started it! Not them! Hey, treasure! I haven't explored all the planets in our... Uh, homeworld vicinity, so I really should do that, but I'm too busy just... Collecting spice and making money, you know? It's so hard to focus on exploring the galaxy when you're just making money. Cash money. And besides, I honestly can't explore the galaxy to its fullest until I can buy worm a wormhole key. Which, yeah. I don't know, because you have to, to be able to go through wormholes. Because it will take freaking forever to fly manually to the center of the galaxy. Like, that will take so freaking long. So yeah, I gotta I got hope I find a wormhole that will lead me nearby. It was me, Dio! <laughs> so what was I gonna do? Oh yeah, make cash money. Sorry, I, for I forgot. <laughs> you guys wanna buy pink spice yet? It'd be great at my home world. Oh wait, what did we get? Book of Science? Scrolls of Order. Scroll of order? So like I'm just gonna sell it. I don't I don't care. I know order is the diplomats, but it wasn't the same kind of thing as the other ones. I, I don't really care. You guys wanna buy the pink spice for a lot of money again? It'd be really great if you did. Yes, yeah, seventeen thousand each. Yeah. More monies. I do not apologize. Spoiler third. Okay, uh, well, now that- oh, oh, hey, I see colony there! What did I say? You are not allowed to build more colonies! You are not allowed to build more colonies, I'm sorry. I really should buy the better bomb. Because I, I, I bomb a lot of planets, don't I? Bomb. Bomb, yeah. Bye-bye, <laughs> thanks for your money, goodbye! Don't stop building on this planet! <laughs> Speaking of making the monies, yes. Okay, well now that we did that, let's go blow up a colony of the Lota Beast Empire because they decided to declare war on us. So, or else they're going to keep attacking this planet of mine over here if I don't. So, hello there. Well, there's still question mark, meaning I haven't technically talked to them yet. Other than their demands to ask me for money. Here we go. Praise the Red of Spode. Uh, I'll see you in the battlefield. No way in heck am I giving them money. Money is my one true love! <laughs> I will never give it up! Boom. Got a, got the Conqueror badge. I unlocked basically a, a better version of every single weapon I already have. You see all those things I unlocked? It's great. We are now the Renowned. Did that money I was hold, picking up actually end up in my... Th what is that ship they have? I want to see that ship. Hold on. It is called Horror Head. Horror Head 3. Oh yeah, it's just a floating... scary head. <laughs> okay, cool. Not gonna question how it flies through space. A.B. Crabs. Yes. Back with dinner, realizing I haven't made dinner yet. I'm spending hours and hours losing my sanity over my May game. Yes, I know that feeling very much. Or do you guys have any other colonies, or do you only have that one colony in your home world? Because I'll happily blow up your other colonies if you have them. Anything on this system? No, not really. Uh, let's go visit your home world. Oh, you own two planets of your home system. Eh, both, both are red spice. That's lame. Do you guys own any? You guys own this planet? Or this system? Nope. Uh, T1 yellow planet? Eh. I don't need yellow planet. I've got one of every spice, at least. So, one planet of every spice, so... Unless we find another, like, pink or purple one. You don't have enough energy to use what tool? Oh, is it another galactic? Cool, look at this! It's a wormhole! I didn't realize this was a wormhole! There's a wormhole right over here, guys. Wow, I didn't, I didn't think, I didn't realize that was a wormhole. All right, that is, uh, that can lead to great things, or it can lead to absolutely nothing. Who knows? Well, we'll, we'll we're not gonna find out until we go in. 
Spaceships don't need to be aerodynamic. I think I might actually die due to lack of energy. Not gonna lie. Okay, do I even have enough energy to t pick stuff up off the ground? I hope so. Yeah, I can still pick up stuff off the ground even with zero energy. Yay! Leads to the center of the galaxy. Dude, that would be amazing if it did. That'd be freaking amazing if it did. Because that's, that's the end goal. Why, well, I, that's what I would, you know, literally would want it to be. So uh, we're going to save the game because I have a feeling I'm going to die just by f trying to fly back to my home world. Which is fine if that happens. It just it, The game likes to crash when I die. Boom. <laughs> I died! Oh, darn! Yes, I know. It was terrible. Don't stop dying. Sincerely, the game. And I, I think it put me back at that planet that I w that's right by the Lota Beast Empire. I thought that said you picked up a shiny Gudra instead of a shiny Geode. <laughs> oh! I didn't realize I built buildings on this planet. I, I guess I can mine pink spice over here, too. I mean, that's kind of... Irrelevant, given that I have a T3 homeworld planet with a with pink spice on it way over here. But eh, there we go. I unlocked the wormhole key. In Interstellar Drive Three. I gotta find someone who sells it though, and they're really really expensive. So got 21 pink spice though. That's a lot. That's 29,000 each. Boom, a million. They cost oh, wormhole keys cost a million th three million dollars. Three million. We're gonna sell this shiny geode too. Um, oh, we also got interstellar drive three, larger health, ju a bigger bomb, a better auto blaster, an antimatter missile. Uh, wow. We have a lot of things we could buy, <laughs> but the wormhole key is the most important. Uh, I th should I should I buy better bombs? Hold on, does, does... Oh, really cool, I got a money badge. Because I'm holding a lot of money. Well, I got two money badges in a row. For all that money I just got there. Okay. Um, do my trader friends want to sell anything to me? I need to, my, I need to find more empires that want to sell better stuff. Because... Yeah, we don't have... Oh, they'll sell it for only uh, one and a half million. That's great. I will totally buy it from them. Hey, have some red spice. I'm also going to buy this Mega Proton Missile. That's quite a lot of money. Wait. Yes, I am totally going to buy that. I know that was a lot of money, and I've... But, you know, I can make a lot more. Bombs away. Yeah, I'm getting this because I feel like I'm more likely to be attacked than me attacking somebody else, and missiles are how you defend against other... Sh other how you attack ships that are attacking you, you know? Okay, while well, we're waiting for our colonies to generate more spice... Let's go explore over this direction. We haven't gone this direction yet. Oh, uh, can I even reach those stars over there? I don't know if I can. I haven't seen this one. Planet Klein. No, th no thanks, Planet Klein. Um, I might be able to reach those with Interstellar Drive 3. Because that's what those Interstellar Drives do. Increase your circle around your ship that you can... That increases your range of flight. So, um, anything in this system? No, nothing at all. Okay. Maybe I should buy the... Interstellar Drive to see if I could fly over there. I haven't seen this planet yet either. Or this system. Just a single yellow planet. These are really boring planets I'm finding. Or boring systems with boring planets. I haven't gone past the Conkeldur Empire yet either. I haven't gone that direction. Yeah. Oh, there's actually a lot down there. Let's go recharge our fuel. Before we keep exploring the galaxy. I've also noticed, though, I, I have not upgraded my... In, at my, uh energy capacity ever. I feel like I should do that, and I have not found another, another empire that sells a, a cheap, for cheaper, so I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna bite the bullet and buy it from my own empire. Now I should have more energy to, fl to fly around. See, see, I haven't, even, I haven't even seen this system right over here. What is here? Uh, nothing at all. Are there any more empires over here? Oh, there's someone over there. Let's go talk to them. I hope they're anything but zealot. Anything but zealot. I'd even be happy if they were a warrior. I know warriors are just as 
jerkish as zealous. We haven't met a warrior yet, so we can do a new adventure. And hey, treasure! And these are a lot, a lot of T1 planets over here. But they're all yellow, so who cares? We don't care about yellow spice. Alright, what's this treasure? It's an art tool. That's fine. I like art. What is this? I can now make the planet green. Cool. So we're we just going to leave the Cogner Emperor with their own home planet? Yes. And I will always obliterate their colony if they ever build more. Same with Loda Beast. If they build another colony, I'm going to just blow it up. Because it, it always... It, no matter how many times I destroy the same planet, it still adds one point to my how many planets I've conquered. And that just adds points to my Conqueror Badge. My Conqueror Badges, you know? Boom. I now one-shot pirates with this missile. One-shot pirate ships. Not to be confused with pirate ships on the sea. Like, actual flying. F is for flying throughout the starscape. U is for your... U is for uranium. Bombs. N is for never making friends with Zell. That's, that didn't really go along with the melody of the song, but... I, I like the... I like it. So you're farming. Planet Valora? Frugi is the name of the creature there. What? Valora? That sounds like something. What is... Where, I, where have I heard that before? Valora? I know I've heard that name somewhere before. Because you said it wrong. <laughs> no, I didn't. You added an ing to that make. Well, that didn't make it a, sent a, a proper sentence if I did that. <laughs> Choo-choo train is under the station. <laughs> hey, welcome. Um... What, what did we get again? We got, did we get a treasure or something? Oh, hey, bits! 1126 bits from Pip! Thank you for your... Th <laughs> Pip! Pip, no! No! <laughs> Thank you very much, Pip! I appreciate the bits in the subscription! Thank you very much, dude. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, it's 13 months in a row. Really happy you're enjoying your time as boss and your purple badge. Not some purple badge. Sorry, I'm used to saying that. You're faced by my your name and the rock on emote and, you know... 43 minutes from 11! Immediate damage to Pip! Will you reset? No. Not anymore. I'm dead! No! Now I must destroy him again! Ah-ha! <laughs> Ah-ha-ha! Uh -huh, uh -huh. uh -huh. How dare you build on this planet again? We talked about this. We've talked about this many times. Our next investment should be definitely the better bomb. I know we want to get to the wormhole, but that costs a lot of money compared to how much we're making right now. Pip, you should save your money. <laughs> I've begun formulating a project. Oh, cool. What kind of project? As Jax is just going to ignore that. <laughs> Let's just ignore the... It completely ignore Pip's reign of terror. And I just see that the Vlota Beast just built another planet, too. I cannot allow that. Wait. Oops, wrong number. Sorry, wrong... I, I meant to land on a home world, not you guys. Sorry. You sent birthday money on bits? Pokemon D&D. &D. Oh! I think that technically is a thing, sort of. Statue of the Three Crickets. Ah, uh, wisely worth 22000 I feel like it'd be worth a crap ton. Um... Like, I, I, it was, a, it was like, Pokemon tried to make an official, like, role-playing tabletop game for, based on Pokemon, but it wasn't very good. Alright, hey guys, hey, hello. I, I see you, I see you built a colony. I'm sorry, but in, this is my quadrant of the galaxy, and I forbid you from building any more colonies. Thanks! Thank you, I will just collect, I will just blow this up and collect this money as, t as taxes. Thank you, goodbye. Have a nice day. Sincerely, the Rokons. <laughs> was the tabletop game any good? I never played it, but, um, I heard about it, I heard about it, I heard it wasn't very good. I also don't remember what it was called. So I wouldn't be able to tell you what to search for. So, how much, how much pink spice has this plant generated? 
Yeah, I remember that Jay Witz video. Yeah, Jay, Jay Witz actually talked about it. Tra trading figure game? It wasn't actually that, no. It w he did do a video on the... I think it was... I think his video was called, like, Pokemon D&D &D or something. But that's not what the official game was called. That's what his, the title of his video was called, I think. I don't remember, though. Only two purple... Oh. This plan is being... Blood my pirates, the one I'm literally fl f hovering over. They're no longer plotting my spies. Okay, thanks. All you have to do is arrive, and they stop plundering usually. So does that mean I can get my purple spice? Because uh, purple spice is really expensive, and I like it. All right, would you like to buy some pink spice? Fourteen thousand. That's good enough. Yay! Boop. With my blue spice plant in the same system when I buy some purple? 19,000! And they want to buy red, too. Nice. If you guys want to buy red, let's go collect some more red real quick. Um, this, pl this plant over here should have some red. Pokemon Junior. It's called Pokemon Junior? That's a kind of an odd name. Yeah, that's a decent price for blue. Okay, good. Not the board game. No, not the board game. The board game was... It's its very, like, not a great game, but it's still fun, <laughs> in my opinion. Was it Pokemon Master Trainer 1999? No. That's a board game. Uh, yeah. I, I guess I don't know what it was called. Alright, like, can we go buy the bomb now? I forgot how much it cost. Are you guys a five-star empire yet? No, you're still four-star. Th these guys are still building up their empire constantly. I'm proud of them. Uh, I could just buy... Ooh, yes, I can buy the bomb. Do it. And we're also buy the Interstellar Drive 3. Da-da-da, we can now fly further. Look at our range now. It's really big. Megalovania place. <laughs> Pokemon Junior game. Worlds to life. Pit boss was activated. <laughs> oh goody! No, I didn't heal. Thank you. My junior adventure gameplay with emergency. No, no, it wasn't. It, we, they've already said what it is. All right. Well, now that I have better bombs and the better to fly, the fly more. Uh, hold on, 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 hold on. Hey, hey, hey! I said hold on. Save the game. I want to casually destroy the cockleders. Because I'm kind of sick of them existing. No offense to you, but I hate it when people exist. So, you must you must pay for your sins of existing. I'm going to use my... It's, it's just a bomb. Boom. 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 Uh, this is not... Destroying as fast as I thought it would be. Oh, I, I blew the. I thought I didn't. I meant I blew up the city. Aww. I blew up one of their cities. But you exist as well. Oh, crap. <laughs> Should I draw a mecha pit but in more detail? Aww. It's just a bomb, bro. You're getting wrecked. Apparently. I guess the Congolers are actually strong, unlike the Snaraxons. Oh yeah, Planet Tegissa, remember that whole thing? Yeah, that's a T2 planet that doesn't have spice on it. And yet it will, and it, yet it collects spice. Yeah, I, I guess, the, I thought the Just the Bomb was stronger, but I, I guess it's not. It's not that, it's like, it's really not much stronger at all. It's hardly noticeable difference. That one's mine. See, I still don't understand. Like, the, there's no pattern whatsoever. Oh, hey, this money is still here. Hold on, guys. Let me grab this money. I've noticed no pattern whatsoever as to whether or not a city blows up or is conquered when you're dropping bombs on it. No pattern whatsoever. So, 
Sometimes just blowing up the... I try to build up, blow up the buildings around the, the city hall. Or, as, or just drop them straight on the city hall. Or I just try to destroy specific buildings. I don't know. No pattern whatsoever. Try not to break it this time. Gee, thanks, game. I'll do that. Yes. Actually, I'll do whatever I want with my ship. Thanks. This game... The game cannot tell me what it... What I am and I'm not allowed to do with my ships. And is it just me or do they have very few ships trying to stop me from taking over their planet? <laughs> and it, also the turrets are not shooting at me for some reason. Their turrets are not shooting at me. Wow. That sure sucks, doesn't it? And there's definitely more cities on this planet. I have one HP. There's more cities on this planet than there were on the Snaraxon at a home planet, so this will take a bit longer to conquer. What killed me? <laughs> Whatever. You can't tell me what to do, game! <laughs> Captain Dinsai is 007 when it comes to vehicles. <laughs> Basically. He can't bring them back in one piece, yep. Okay, let's save the game just so we can save our progress on conquering the system. And then once the Conqueror's are, uh... Once the Conqueror's are, you know, once his home planet is gone, well, they're gone forever. And then, it, and then if I destroy the load of beasts, it'll just be me and my friends. That's it. Me and my two friends in this quadrant of the galaxy. Wait, no, quadrant implies a fourth. No, it's... No. This little tiny piece of the galaxy. Once more, the Rokon will rule the galaxy! And we shall have peace. <laughs> anyway, his peop he can't bring them back, and his people are Q. This the sector, your neighborhood. Ow, ow, stop! Okay, they're trying harder now. Guys, stop trying harder. It's nice that the Rokons have apparently mastered cloning. What number did size is now? Ah! <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> I've been keeping count. Definitely several. We died like for once for every city on at least uh, uh, taking over this Naraxon home planet, and they had five cities on there and that. Thirty-five. I don't think it's thirty-five. But if you want to just guess a random number like Pip did for the Kingdom Hearts deaths, go ahead. And also, I've noticed, now that I've destroyed a lot of the empires around, I'm getting attacked a lot less. Imagine, how that, imagine that, right? Yeah, imagine how that stuff works out. I think they only have two cities left. We should be able to get them in this run. Right? Ah, that one blew up! See? What, what, what made that one blow up? As opposed to getting conquered. Um, that wasn't their last city. Am I missing something? Oh, it's hiding in the corner of the map. I can barely see it. Okay, never mind. We'll probably it'll probably take one more life, unless I get lucky with this one. Got it. Mine. I claim this place. Oh, no, you don't. All for a Muju and six for a dollar. I see, maybe 15, maybe 20. Yeah, the Conqueror Empire has been destroyed. You're destroying your own buildings. No, I'm not! <laughs> it wasn't my own building when I was blowing it up. I mean, it is now, of course. All right, let's collect the money from that one. That, you know, I wish it wasn't... I wish it didn't blow up, but whatever. This is just a red spice planet. I'm not going to care too much about it. I just want to make sure none of the buildings want to riot. None of the cities want to riot, you know? Um, what is this? That's just a house. Um, there, that works. That city is fine. Which city am I on right now? Okay, that city is fine. Let's do this one next. Um... This house can't possibly help. Get rid of it. That was a house, right? Oh, I don't really care. 
And this one currently has, like, nothing in it. Is that a factory? That's a factory. And what is this? A house. Okay, we'll build one entertainment. That's it. That city's good. Not for this city. Balvin with the might of Sting! Oh yes, I forgot. That was a that was a thing. I completely forgot. That's th yeah. We fight for the glory of Sting. Totally. Not for money and glory. Of ourselves. Yeah. Sting. We'll go with that. All right. Um. Is there any way I can double double up on the entertainment? No, I can't. That's fine. Okay, that one's good. Let's see this one. Bolly we're sting! Our ship is on fire and it's still not blowing up! Oh, don't you know? Fire just means you're low on HP! It doesn't have any actual re ramifications. That's a word, right? Are these all factories? No, that's a house. Okay, so we got two houses and a factory. We gotta build an entertainment here. Okay. That one's good now, right? Yep, that city is good. Two more cities to go. Well, I guess we have another planet that gives red spice at a very very good rate, I guess. And I've also noticed that even though they, like, have the same amount of cities, home planets that you capture from other people, they produce spice faster than your home planet. Which I'm not quite sure how. But they do. So this will produce red spice faster than my home planet, but, you know, at the same time, who cares? It's frickin' red spice. Bobbin for the sting or well or well do nothing. Menacingly. Exactly. Alright, these are just houses that are doing nothing. They will do something though when I put this entertainment here. Yay. And that's it. That city is good. Boom, done. Sting is our Luigi. He wins by doing absolutely nothing, yes. Oh, well, see, it's already it's already collected lots of it's already it's collecting spice as we're just sitting looking at it. But of course, it's red spice. Red spice makes old spice body washing power. <laughs> yes, absolutely. All right, see, see, well, during all that, Volkadox only got two red spice during all that. Okay, well, during all that uh, nonsense, how much did our 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 Literal money-making machine planet make. 22! Yeah! Hey, planet right next door. Do you want to buy some pink spice? Eh, 11,000 is not good enough. Or is this system right here? Hello. I purchased a purple spice homeworld and made lots of bank. Yeah, I found, a, I found that once in all my years of playing this game. A home planet with purple. 14 is good. Mr. Sherm to Pista Sherm. Oh, Buzzig Muflergnerg. <laughs> I'm, I'm quoting the game. I'm not just speaking nonsense. 19,000. Ooh, you guys want to wanna buy red. Oh, well, I got news for you. I got lots of red. It's the most common thing. All right. Um, loyalty booster. I could buy more energy. I don't know if I want to buy more energy. I think I should be saving up for the wormhole now. The wormhole key. Am I going to get another badge? Or badge? I do. Wow. I'm, I've gone up in rank again. I think I get three ho three ships now. Gotta love pseudo-sims babble. Yeah. Alrighty. Uh, yeah, I can have three allied ships if only I had, if only I had three friends. Alright. Uh, i got to destroy this Lota Beast uh, colony right here because we can't allow that. That's, that's crap. You guys are not allowed to... Should I blow them up too? I wonder if I should blow them up too, or if I should keep them as uh, colony destro destruction fodder. Meaning, I keep them alive just so they can constantly rebuild colonies, and I can constantly re destroy it over and over just to keep getting points towards the conqueror badge. I think I'll do that. I'll keep you guys alive because it suits my interests of getting badges and money. That's the only reason. Okay, so can we fly to this area over here yet? Can we reach these stars? We can! Alright, we're about to go over here for the first time. There's an empire over there, apparently. Alright, you guys are just a T1 red. Wow. Taxes. <laughs> yeah, taxes! <laughs> Alright, T1 yellow. 
Nothing injured. Do I have a colony pack with me? I do have a colony pack, so I can build a colony over here if I if I find something good. Nothing. No, I, it's so so suck. You know, with the billions of planets that, that the galaxy generates, you know, most of them are going to be bad. There's only there's only so many good ones. All right, there's treasure here. What is this treasure? Just don't try that on the Yoshi Empire. <laughs> nice. Murder everything. You can artificially create a homer by evolving a non-sentient creature into a sentient creature on the planet you want. Yes! That That is absolutely true. You can do that. But then you have to, you know, conquer them. Which, you know, isn't hard. But it is an extra step. Did I see this one yet? I don't remember. I think I did. Billions? I think there are billions. Maybe not billions. I, I think there are. At least in real life galaxies, there are billions. Lots of T1. Oh, T0 green. I already, I already have a green that's good, though. Wow, that's like... This is like the middle of nowhere, this one. Oh! T2 already... In, in, it has a tribal stage, people. We'll go meet those guys over there. What if Yoshi had no money? That's why he committed tax fraud. <laughs> That's why he evades taxes, exactly. All right, let's go talk to you guys, whoever you are. Please be a type of empire we haven't met yet so I can do a new adventure. They're happy. They might be a, they're, they're a diplomat or a traitor. They're another traitor. Another traitor. Phasma. Oh, it looks like a, like a phantom, like a spooky floating phantom ghosty thing. Um, they're traitors though. They're not a new empire we haven't met yet. That we already we have that we have the eons already, but uh, but we'll have these guys are easily eas they can we can easily make an ally out of them. So that's good. But they have a blue spice homeworld. They have a blue spice homeworld, huh? Maybe it'd be in my best interest to conquer them. Even though they'd, I could easily be their friend. It might be in my best interest to conquer them. How did that even start, the whole Yoshi tax fraud thing? The same way memes always start. One person randomly posts something they think is funny, and someone reposts it. Like, I think that's funny too. And then it just goes over and over and over and over and over and over. Maybe eleven think. All right, I'll think about it for a while. Oh no, we're being invaded by pirates. Crap. Alien ships are raiding your. Okay, well that. We should go back. Uh, let's. I must be on a planet. Yeah, I find that weird. I must be on a planet to use my return ticket ability. Um, so I have to fly into this planet right here. Let's take a look at it. They've got a lot of planets to con. They've got a lot of cities I have to conquer. Back to the home world. See? I, that's why I like the shaman's ability. You can do that at any time. Just zip back to your home world instantly. Yes, I know. We're under attack by pirates. I know. The same same story. They're attacking the purple planet. I hate that. <laughs> they keep attacking my purple planet. Wait, there's nothing here. Oh, wait! They're not attacking this planet. They're attacking the one next door. They're attacking the blue one. Okay, you guys can have the blue one. Apparently our ships can make mini wormholes? Yes. That's the ability of shamans. We can teleport to our home world instantly. Pew, pew, pew. Pew, pew. Goodbye. Ah! Running into a rock formation. Who's destroying? Who's attacking my base? I don't see anybody attacking my base. Maybe it was the guy I just blew up. He like shot something and it hit before, you know, he died or something. Yay! Goodbye. 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 Peace. They're no longer attacking. Haha. <laughs> Thanks. Did you know you can get uh, you can collect spice on the planet from the trade menu? You just buy it for zero dollars. I knew you could do that, but I forgot that you could do that until just now. 
Fear our Cosmog cannons! Apparently our ships can make me- yes. Don't you hate it when you crash your space into a mountain while fending off pirates? <laughs> I know, I hate it when that happens! Such an inconvenience. So hashtag relatable! <laughs> yup. Hey, hey, money. I, I spy some cash money. You know how I feel about money, and I just picked up a tree, I guess. We'll use that to call- we'll use that to terraform a planet someday. Probably, maybe. Alright, so how much has our pink planet gi given us now? Eighteen. Nice. Uh, you guys don't want to buy anything, though. Do you guys want to buy anything? Should I add buildings to this red planet here? Eleven thousand? Nah, I could do better than eleven thousand for pink. Um, no, I don't, I don't want to add anything to that. Uh, I just collected from you guys. Uh, I haven't collected from you guys in a while. Alright, I have never built up your empire. I've not built up, I haven't collected from you guys in a while. Do you guys want to buy some pink? No, they don't want to buy it at all. Uh, 8,000, I'll buy, I'll sell the blue though. You know, I think I should, I'm going to see if I can increase this, this, this capacity, because I feel like it keeps going over capacity. Like, I, oh, I don't have, I don't think I have enough animals. Hold on. Whatever. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make this a T2 plant so I can add a second building. A second city here, so I can increase the spice capacity of this planet to 10 instead of 5. Because I feel like it keeps getting maxed out while, because I don't collect from it all that much, so... This should help a little at the very least. And I'll just buy another colony pack from somebody. Oh, I gotta fill out the... Fill out the... I, I did get a new type of tree just a minute ago. Pew! I don't need to repick it up. Um... A Xylus and a Joan. Yay! Uh... Yeah, I have these animals here already. I gotta go find new animals! Quick, we gotta hurry before the before the atmosphere destabilizes. Because that's totally how planets work. The atmosphere will destabilize if I don't add more animals. Well, let's just collect animals from my home world. It's my home world. I don't care if it... If, oh, I should probably recharge while I'm here. Any aminals around? Aminals. Is my whole planet extinct of animals? That's the that's the gist I'm getting right now. Oh, here's something. What is that? That is an herbivore. Good. What are you? You are a carnivore. I need one more herbivore. I'm good. Oh, hello. I saw you. I saw you. Oh, wait. Hello. I'll get you guys instead. What are you? Herbivore. Good. Done. That species cannot survive in water. Place them on land. <laughs> there are no species that survive in water in this game. None. Except cells. But they don't exist as, you know, a creature type. Okay, where were we building up this one right here? Look, see, it's already at three, that quickly. So yeah, it's 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 gathering spice at a rather rapid rate. Okay, let's put down this Darfna, a Dich, and a Kratu bird. Yay! We filled out this planet. Now let's build a new colony. We're going to put it over here. It'll make it very minimal. Just uh, one more factory, one more entertainment. I can't live all the planets to do this to. I do it to a red spice planet. Oh well. I have a lot of other planets I feel like would benefit from this more, but... Eh. I just don't like when something's at capacity and it's, you know, overflowing and it's not collecting anymore. 
I haven't collected from these green guys in a while either. Let's go. Let's go visit them. You guys want to buy some pink spice? Twelve thousand. I guess that's all right. I'll always get more, and that's not bad for red either. Back to a million. Just five hundred thousand more, and we get a wormhole key. Hey, they're at five star. They're a five star empire now. Yeah, their their empire is getting pretty far. I just realized we never met the empire that was down here when we were going this direction. We had to turn around for some reason. I forgot what that reason was. Let's vi let's. Oh, hey, a treasure. Let's explore these planets over here. Treasure. Oh, that's a art tool. That's fine. I like art. I have returned. Hey, welcome, Minette. Welcome to exploring space. That's what we're just exploring right now. How long are you guys going to keep this place we're going? Basically, after we reach the Galactic Center, I want to do all the Maxis made adventures. If we hadn't done, if we haven't done them already throughout our course through the space stage. Oh my God! Three treasures in one system. At least one of these is a trap. This one was. Um, and then I also want to do some player-made adventures that I have in mind. There are some really good ones out there that I kind of want to show off. Welcome back, Captain. I see you have the Edgeblade 11 icon. A rare sight. Yeah, not too many people have that, because, you know, three. I feel like that's the least common. Um... Anyway, yeah, uh, after this, after we do all that stuff I just talked about, um, next game up is Yoshi's Island, and then Paper Mario. And then, of course, then we'll be doing RuneScape for the end of, until the end of time, because of how much there is to that game. And that would be it, guys. Can you, can, you, could, can you believe we're that close to being done with my, oh wait, Undertale. I always forget Undertale. Because that's... Some, because that's I'm going to do something special with. Okay. I've been making lots of D&D characters. Like, like way too many D&D characters. Interesting. I actually... And I do enjoy the character making process, but I'm just really so picky about certain things that like... After I finish making a character, I'm like, okay. I'm done. This is my character, and I don't feel like making another one. I, I like tweaking and refining... One character... As I go, and instead of, you know, making lots, but I do like making characters. Uh, let's check on our new red planet. What do you guys got? Michael of any intensifies. 29 red spice! That is a lot, but it's red spice, so. Alright, you got 19. You guys got nothing. Oh, wait, hey! You pink guys want to buy 31 red spice? For 4,000, I could do better than that. Green spice for 10,000, though, is pretty good. Do you guys, guys want to buy pink spice? For 11,000. No, 11,000 is not good enough. I just like character concepts, like a gift necromancer who asks permission of the undead before making them fight for him. <laughs> nice. And we're being attacked by pirates. Of course, it's our purple, purple planet, of course. Stop attacking my purple planet! I like my purple planet! I should... I... They're no longer planting my spice because I... All I did have to do... I ha, all I had to do was show up. And here, 14,000 for pink. Take it. One has to wonder how much time is passing in-game over the course of the space stage. Ah, uh, good question. I don't know. I know time is definitely scaled. Like... It does not play in real time. It's, at least it's not meant to. Actually, 11,000 for purple is actually really cheap. No, I don't want that. This is about 100 years already. I guess we'll find out. Um, it doesn't actually say... It says how long I've been... How long the species has existed. But... Oh, wait. 400 million years. Okay, hold on, hold on. Started plus zero years. Yeah, we've been in existence... We've been... Our species exists for 4,607,000,000 years. 
before it got reached space, but it does not say how many years have passed during space stage. It, the, the years at the top of the timeline disappear. That's interesting. But like these, like cell stage technically lasted billions of years. Um, so, uh. Apparently, mine and Amy's character again knew each other before meeting a new group. My character suddenly suggested being nearly caught by a thief. She said Amy's character, in her words, stole her heart. Yeah, that makes no sense for anyone, basically except Eleven. <laughs> but, but yes, that is definitely that is a thing that happened. Here, sixty thousand is good for one. Good for a purple spice. You know, we only have one though. Didn't we find a treasure? The fossil that everybody finds. Okay. The gift of our in civil war. It was one submarine when I committed genocide upon the race of their former slaves, where the other thought there had been enough violence, the exile and slavery would be enough. The little fighting a war with the acceptance of violence permitted. That is interesting. Well, why am I going back to my home world? I don't know, it's just a force of habit, I guess. Did you guys give me more pink spice already? Only four. I'm going a little fast. Alright, let's go let's do some more exploring. See this planet here. Where is that empire that was? Oh, they're over here. There's also oh, there's someone right here. Let's go see who they are. Treasure of the AE Empire. Remember machine life you wrote. They sound. So I've, I'm not sure who what kind of empire that is. I want to say Bard, because if it is, that's someone we haven't met yet. So great, we can do a new adventure. That's great if that's what that is. There's a treasure on this moon of this gas planet. And eh, never mind, it's a trap. Boom. Yeah. Bet they regret that. Fossil that everyone finds says the fossil equivalent of fool's gold. Probably. We doing nature? Oh, never mind. More shamans. No? Wait. Oh, ecologist! World be fruitful. I think they're ecologist. Well, I gotta see what they are for sure. Oh, they wanna buy some yellow spice. Take it. And pink. And I can afford a wormhole key. I can't afford both the wormhole key and this medium energy storage, though, but I want this, so whatever. We'll get more money. Gotta wait for this this ecologist. And once again, it's directed at their feet. Wow. They're ecologists, so okay, we do, we do get a new, advent, new adventure. Biological catastrophe, let's do it. Okay, um, before we do that, let's examine this creature. The AU Empire. It's by that same guy, Doom Nova. He made the Eon Empire, too. So, yeah, he likes putting f mouths in characters' feet, apparently. But this guy actually moves normally, so... Whatever. No respect for the dad. Will they give you bardic inspiration? <laughs> No, because they're ecologists. Um, all right, let's do an adventure. This one's not bad. This is the ecologist adventure. That thing looks really rad, not going to lie. Yeah, I think it looks like a cool creature. It's just I have a huge nitpick of mine that uh, the mouth is not on the head. So and the, when the, you're looking at the transmission, you know, the game, it, the, it zooms in at the bottom of their ha bottom half of them, so... Adventure time! Yes! Investigate a crashed alien ship. Search for signs of life. Make sure the nearby region's base is safe. Spoilers, it's not safe. <laughs> they dead. <laughs> Alright, look at it. Let's check out this alien ship. Come along! Grab your friends! With Dinsai and question mark? The impact created quite... Created quite a crater. Is that meant to be a tongue twister? Created quite a crater. Created quite a crater. Okay. No signs of life, but some might have survived. I, did, I, actually, I accidentally skipped through that second line. But oh well. A body! 
The skin is green and lumpy. It doesn't look like damage from the crash. What if they raise a foot over their head after taking a bite so the gravity allows the food to travel through the stomach? <laughs> We're trying to explain the biology of the Rokon. <laughs> okay, I, I would I would advise against that. <laughs> Well, when there are ice ball, I assume you're going to check out the wreckage in our front yard. I'm here to tell you, but you couldn't have picked the worst time to visit. Most of the crew is sick right now. Or dead. Cough! Coughing! Aw, oh, everyone's sad. The name's Ning. Ben Ning. I'm the station's state meteorologist. Everything's gone, gone to heck around here. Most men are either missing, sick, or dead. Commander disappeared yesterday. I guess that puts me in charge. The men, they, they just sort of look sick, and then they went crazy. What's worse, Palma and his daughter Efty with him when, when he flew in. Now she's missing too. Poor little Efty. The footmouth people. I doubt the Rokon could raise a foot over their head without assistance. <laughs> They'd fall. Darn machine! Everything's on the fritz! Cooper could fix this. If we could find him, no one seems to let the sick bay. He must be frozen solid by now. Okay, now I gotta move to the grave, which is right here. I don't know why they have that as an objective, because you have to move here in order to examine this. Whatever. More alien skin. This looks like fresh. This looks fresh. Where does it lead? Let's follow the green glowing goo. Talk to the infected alien and FD. Move to the graveyard party. Yeah, I was thinking that too. <laughs> no. I, 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 sorry. Men scared of me. They get sick. I so sorry. Big sick from Sky, my planet. FD, help me. Help me hide. But I know her. To her look. She okay. She okay. No sick from me. Men all sick soon. You go. Make help. Leave me! Bye-bye! Take a leave! Take after me! Bye-bye a go-go! <coughs> that hurt my throat a lot. I'm FD! Are you sick? I'm not sick! I just want my daddy back! Take me home! Alright! Escort mission! We gotta get we gotta get the only survivor off the planet, because everyone else has now turned to zombies. Oh, hello. I see you're trying to attack me. Zoop. Dead. That was a mistake. We don't have a ranged weapon yet, do we? I guess I'll do this and this. Take that. Bye-bye, go go Alright, goes this alien with a Team Rocket member for a time. Basically, yes. FD! Wait, where'd she go? Is she stuck behind a wall? Yeah, she's stuck behind a wall. FD, get over here. Get, 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 get over here. <laughs> come on! Come on, FD, come on, come on! <laughs> okay, oh my god. Kids, am I right? Alright, um... Oh, wait, did... Who are you saying died to? You didn't notice I was here yet. CHARGE! Dead. The joys of escort missions! Yeah, it's actually not bad. Because you only have to fight, like, one enemy at a time, and as long as you only fight them one at a time, you should be fine. I've said before, I've done all the max adventures before without having a weapon, like a, a captain weapon, just using creature stage parts. Attack, like, you know, bite, slash, things like that. And I've, it takes longer, but it's definitely possible. SGX, play RE4. Da! Yeah, dead. Goodbye. Are we going to unlock a new captain part after this mission? I, for I, forgot I forgot our progress on our adventures. I feel like we should. Don't worry, I've heard the horror stories of FE4. Well, we know it's a horror game. Eh. Alright, here we go. We did it. Mission accomplished. Um, oh, she, she was one inch away. It didn't count. Okay. 
Leon screams intensify. Yay, we win! The infection has spread across the entire base, but at least your Azure and her natural immunity may lead to a cure. Yay, new Captain Park! Da -da -da -da. I already know what I'm going to get. I'm going to get this, the Swarm Magnet. It lets me summon a swarm of bees and, and send them to attack an enemy. Yes. I want to... I want to. Now I play, but I play the others. Okay. Alright, so, uh, these guys might already want to ally with us. Look at this. Look at that. Well, be an ally with us. Boom. Already an allied with them. Cool. We have three friends now. Let's make... Let's keep them alive. Uh, let's examine their ship, though. What kind of ship do they have? The Quasar Mothership Red Shift. Wow, that looks pretty cool. That actually looks like a sci-fi spaceship. Now, yeah, totally. That's really cool. Okay. There are, these are only a level 1 empire, so I do not want this ship with me, because it will very easily die. Um, uh, just, you know, I have three friends now, so if they ever do increase their empire to be really strong, then I could have, you know, good ships flying around with me and stuff. I haven't seen this planet yet. What's this planet? You guys will probably colonize it. It's a pink planet. Not the bees! Dr. B! Really? Pirates again? Okay. Pew! Pew! Looks like a Nebulon B from Star Wars. I'm not sure what that is, but I, I'm i not surprised if it, if it does. Another treasure! This one's actually treasure, right? Yeah, it is! Oh, there's two treasures! And they're, like, right next to each other! What are the frickin' odds? This actually looks like a spaceship! What a novel concept! Find a book of science. I now have two books of science! I have yet to find a scientist! Lame. Um, although... Hey, hold on. Um... Let's go meet that other empire that was down this way. The Makuta Empire. <gasps> diplomats! Oh, I totally want to be friends with them! They love- they like friends, and diplomats build huge empires. The Makuta- okay. Oh! Oh, that thing looks... Not friendly! <laughs> but it also doesn't look that interesting, but whatever. I, I don't care. I'm glad I found the new empire. Adventure time! Uh... Uh, missions, yeah. Yeah, it sounds like a good adventure. Goodbye, I'm doing it. I recommend saving- oh, thank you very much. I forgot. Right, yeah, these guys are probably my friends too after this mission, because diplomats like friends too. All right, yay! Delicate negotiations. Let's equip our swarm magnet, our bee power. Um, yeah. In my opinion, the swarm magnet and the weapon you get after in this one right here are both extremely helpful. Uh, it's arguable. Whether or not they're more helpful than the warrior versions of it, because, you know, like I said, there's not a whole lot of options for combat. Like, you can either have... Both of these replace Bite, both of these replace Spit, both of these replace Strike, both of these replace Charge. So you can't have... You can't have just whichever four of these eight weapons that you want. So, like, you know, they have this or this, this or this, this or this. Um... It's arguable whether it's better than the warrior version of this weapon, but in my opinion, they are extremely helpful because they stun enemies. It does damage and it stuns enemies because they're like ah bees ah, and then yeah, so they don't they don't attack you for a short while. Makuta Matata. <laughs> my first thought was Makuta, the main antagonist of Bionicle. Anyone? Anyone? No. Okay. Pro tip, after the stream, a giant hamburger wouldn't be a bad idea. Okay. What a wonderful phrase! Friendship is magic. Delicate negotiations, huh? Better bring my bees! <laughs> I 
Vikings just fly and sabers rattle. It's up to you to stop a battle. I really like this adventure. Duke Montalette has a message for you. Delivered to Baron Capagu. I approve your bionicle reference. <laughs> what took you so long? There's work to be done. The evil Baron has kidnapped Julio, my son. I'm choking with rage. I'm ready to roar. If my son's not returned, then we're going to war. Take that scroll behind me and deliver it fast. If the Baron ignores it, my troops will amass. It, it's it's Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> but it, everything rhymes. <laughs> oh, hey, Romeo and Juliet. Yeah. They also don't kill themselves at the end. Spoilers, that's what happens at the end of Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> Spoilers for a extremely ancient story that has existed for centuries. <laughs> Sorry, shouldn't give a spoiler alert. What is it, Dr. Seuss? <laughs> Dr. Seuss plus Shakespeare. Don't I suffer enough poems in school? <laughs> Shake Seuss. I have read these false scribblings and I am displeased. My fair daughter Euromiette is the one that's been seized. I've had, I've heard enough of the foolish Duke's lies. Gather my troops. Today the Duke dies. My daughter has returned to my side. The power of the Capagues cannot be denied. Okay. Well, they're both accusing the other family of kidnapping their child. Okay. Dr. Seuss Spear. <laughs> Seuss Spear! He is a spear of green eggs and ham. <laughs> you know, me and Lab still have birthday decorations up her grandmother bought for our apartment. Okay. Well, that's rather random. Uh, who am I trying to talk to? Oh, this person. Now, this is supposed to be a female. I know it's hard to tell, but... I thought there's only three voices they could pick for adventure characters. Yeah. Where is Rui yet? Let me whisper my tale. If the Baron found out, he'd throw me in jail. His daughter just bought a fine bottle of red to drink with my true love. Yes, that is what she said. To find Rui yet, follow the old dirt trail. That last line didn't rhyme with anything. Zero to ten! Worst adventure! Brought it up as I'm playing with the balloon. Okay, Pip. <laughs> the Seuss Spear is my favorite weapon. <laughs> you leave decorations up so long, and if you could just say you had decorations up early, yes. I have some news about Romiette's fate. She rushed her this morning and said she was late. She was looking for sweets and purchased a cake. Then she ran off on a trip to Forlorn Lover's Lake. She hasn't been kidnapped. She's out on a date. Okay, yeah. Now I gotta talk to Armstrong the blacksmith. Who's over here? Hello. Pip is confirmed five. <laughs> Julio is not missing. Go is into dope. He was just here, then walked towards the slope. He had for me he had me fortune a pure golden band to give to his love and place on her hand. He's been captured, he's going to elope. So why don't you tell the Leader is that. Okay, I know I could go the normal way. I'm just gonna fly there. Whee! Whoosh. Where am I going exactly? It's over here. I took a shortcut. See, I mean, I could break adventures with this, with jumping and flying. I am 23. <laughs> Love triangle. Exactly what a five-year-old would say. How did you find us? Can't you just let us be? That lake's lovely with two, but it's crowded with three. What's that you say? A battle draws near? Father always gets angry when I disappear. If a war broke out, I'd be filled with dismay. So I guess I'll return, though I'd rather much I'd much rather stay. That's also supposed to be a female. I thought we were hidden, far from all danger, but our romantic party's been crashed by this stranger. Oh dear, you say fighting's about to begin? I was head back to protect all my kin. Hiding my true love is making me sad. It's time to go home and confess to my dad. Okay, proceeds to get by a random car. <laughs> I That'd be great if I if I did when I did that jump. 
Now I just literally wait for them to walk all the way back. That's all I can do. Can I, like, attack them? <laughs> they have infinity HP, so... Couldn't kill them, but I probably could attack them. Yay! Can I, can I shoot bees at him? <laughs> bees! Go! <laughs> yes! I good! Kill him, my bees! Okay. <laughs> hey, they didn't make him unattackable, sorry. Well, well, I suppose they made a little mistake. Julio was not kidnapped, he snuck out to the lake! Oops, I was gonna wipe all the capillaries out. Good thing you showed up and prevented this route. Here's to our children to love most divine, Rose of a Spoffet! Tonight we will dine! Love <laughs> Grey's Wonder gets space shanked. A bee? Plantos, they are male actors, like an actual play that has Shakespeare. Wow, that's a really good point. Yeah, fun fact, they thought only males should do theater back when theater was first invented because, you know... <laughs> there was sexism rampant through most of history, unfortunately. Those crazy kids, their young lovers' ways, almost maybe set in Montalette's castle ablaze. It was all just a silly little misunderstanding, but I learned my lesson. I won't be so demanding. My Zoopy Romeo only wanted to wed. Gosh, I feel foolish. Is my face all red? Yeah, you're literally a red-colored species. Is that the joke? That was the adventure. <laughs> now, I like adventures like that. It's an adventure that just tells a story, basically. Ah! <laughs> v, I, I see what you did there. Nice, Joel. Oh, I didn't read the ending thing. Darn. Now you'll never know what it said. Alright, we did that. Will you guys be our friends now? Yay! Friends! Friends! Alliance! Yeah, it's gonna be epic! So what does your ship and your species look like? I don't even know what your species looks like. Even in that story is Space Romeo and Space Juliet. <laughs> to be fair, it was just loosely based on it. Uh, it There wasn't a whole lot of similarities, like in terms of how the story actually went. This is an SNS Diamondback 2. That looks like a freaking R-Wing from Star Fox. That's a straight up R-Wing. It looks really freaking cool, but yeah, I, I think it was definitely inspired by an R-Wing. Yeah, really awesome ship, though. Uh, what does this species look like? Star Fox theme plays. This is what they look like. Oh, okay. Alright, it's not the most horrifying thing I've ever seen. <laughs> it's just, you know... Kinda eh. <laughs> Can't not you steal that, Star Fox? It's basically a decked out R Wing. Yep. Also, you can leave now. You're a level one empire, unfortunately. But like I said, diplomats usually build very large empires, so they shouldn't be level one for too long. And that wasn't even the empire I wanted to meet. The Sand Monster Empire? <laughs> what might you be? Are they? Oh, they're also ecologists. Okay. That looks really cool, though. Well, of nature, yeah, more ecologists. Okay. I don't really care to do the good. I don't really care about you guys. Have some blue spice, though, I guess. You want to buy. You could buy. Oh, I forgot I had the Stone of Life. Here, sell it. <laughs> sounds random, no? Oh, I could buy a wormhole key now. Do you guys sell wormhole keys? No, you don't. Okay. The traders did. They're just four diplomats of. Uh, still as Shakespearean to find the two lovers. Those are your criteria, and the war has been stopped. The planet is saved. The path to world peace has truly been paved. Now our new allies await in the stars. The Makuta Empire's treasury shall be ours. Very nice. Um, how much spice have we collected? Oh, we were maxed out. Sorry, I should have collected it sooner. Uh, here's some red spice for you. The sand monsters? That's what the species was called. What time is it? Oh, it's about 9.30. Darn. I want to keep playing. Uh, where? Wh what's our other planet we want to collect from? Was it this? Was it Plaxel? 
Yeah, that was the one. That was the red. Yeah, that was this one. That we got from the Conkledurs. How much would I buy pink for? Not much at all. Forget about it. I don't want to go to Tagissa. Let's go here. We got three purples. That's nice. You, you purple guys want to buy anything? Pink for 14,000. We'll do it. Mr. Sherm to Pista Sherm. Also, I completely forgot to buy the wormhole key. Now I have way more than I even needed. Oh, uh, you guys don't want to buy anything, though. Okay. It was these guys who sold the wormhole key, right? You guys have treasure on this planet now. Why do you guys keep getting treasure on your planets? Yep. Boop. All right, time to see what's in that wormhole. We're going to go right away. Cause I, just, I just, just out of curiosity. Oh, hey, wait a minute. The Lota Beasts have built two colonies? I need to step up my game. You built on a T1 planet, no less. Lame. How dare you do that? You, you didn't even stabilize the atmosphere, though. Boom. Thank you for your taxes. Two million spore bucks to space! Even further beyond! Yes, even further beyond. You know, it might just warp to some other random part of the galaxy, which, you know, is more likely than somewhere near the center. But even if it's slightly closer to the center than I am now... Oh, crap, we're having a economic disaster. Or not economic, ecological. That's the word, right? Yeah, from eco-disaster. Yeah. Hey, can you stop shooting me? Thanks. I'm just trying to collect my taxes. Did I, did I drop the money by accident? Oh, I gotta go back for it. I might die, but I gotta go back for it. Thanks. The wormhole, the final error frontier. We gotta save planet Alden from eco-disaster first. Which one's Alden? Oh, it's not my own planet. That's why it didn't sound familiar. It's uh, one of my, it's one of their planets. That's fine, I'll go save them. I like them. They're one of my friends. I gotta recharge my energy first, though. You guys wanna buy anything? Oh yeah, sure. Yay, more monies. Yeah, see how much money we're making now? We're making money at a really rapid rate. That is very good. You know, we also gotta start making pro- Yeah, we- Hmm. Sorry, I don't want to finish that set to try to spoil what I'm planning on doing. Um. Yeah, I don't want to say anything about it. Whoa! Did I save it recently? Oh, that. Oh my God. Um, I don't think I've saved recently. Yeah, I got an eco hero badge. Woohoo! Didn't get any rewards for getting the badge, but are we gonna save it instantly? Save. Hooray! Also, do you guys sell colonies? I believe you do. Yes, I'm gonna buy both. And I also want to buy more health. Thanks. Better save like now. Yes, I did. I, I'm gonna save it again after I bought those things. Alright, let's find this wormhole. Where does it lead? Where does it lead? Da 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 da! Alright, I usually like to build a colony right by the wormhole on its exit, assuming it's somewhere good. Where the heck am I? Oh, that's much closer to the center! I mean, it's not amazingly close. Okay, th I like, that's perfect! And there's like empires all around. Wait a minute. Am I in Grox territory? Is this... Oh my god, I've met the Grox. 
I found them, guys. I have found them. Um, that couldn't have been more perfect. I am actually close to the center. I come in peace. It is well that you recognize our superiority. <coughs> um, so, uh, yeah, um, hello. <laughs> hello, Grox. <laughs> Just a wormhole array. So, uh, uh, so, um, yeah. We need to not make them mad. So, anywhere we're near them, turn this off. <laughs> it's, we, c we need to let them shoot us. We cannot shoot them back. I'm going to build a colony right here. And look, look, there's a T1 planet here. Good, so this one. I'll use this one. So I can instantly start putting buildings there. Good. This is going to be my go-to colony when I'm, do it, when I'm over here. I had, uh, I had foreseen this. This bad? Oh my, no, this is, this is perfect. Like, this could not have been more perfect. Uh, wait. It's not filled out? Oh, it needs a carnivore. There you go. Boop, done. Okay, I don't need to have... I don't need to have a factory here, because I don't need to generate spice here. I'm just going to build some turrets. Wait! Yes, I'll build some turrets. And... You know what? I'll just make this... Uh... I'll just make this place happy. This colony will just be happy. And you know what? I changed your mind. No, you guys are going to work for a living. Um... I'll just grab a random factory I made at one point. I don't feel like finding... Terra score too low? Oh. I'm dumb. Never mind, there we go, okay. We are dancing with fire now, ladies and gents. We are indeed. Okay, so, um... Unfortunately, now that we've met the Grox, we've kind of, uh... We've met them a lot earlier than I had anticipated, which... Is, I honestly think is a bad... It, it's great that we found them. It's great that this wormhole right by us leads directly to them, but meeting them this early is actually bad because I'm not ready to deal with them. And I feel like once you've met them for the first time, you start they start appearing as, like, invaders or demanding money from you. Just They can do stuff from across the whole galaxy. That's how powerful they are. Because, you know, other empires you come a kind of... They can only do things, like, in their general vicinity. The Grox... Did the game just lock up? Hold on. I think the game just locked up. Yep, the game locked up. Please stand by. Uh, I did save it right before I went in the wormhole, so I haven't lost... I haven't... There's not really much which, uh, progress I lost. You can go back to when you saved and not go through the wormhole? You're right, I could have. But never mind, it works now. There was the massive lag. Um, but, you know, now that you mentioned that... That might actually be a smarter idea. There's a million wormholes around here. Where is the galactic core from here? Is that it? I think that's it, yeah. Wow, this is actually insanely close. You can avoid bad Grox things? You know, you are right. I'm actually going to do that. Thank you for that suggestion. Exit the main menu. Do not save. Do not save. But, assuming wormholes are set in stone where they go. I don't know if that's true, now that I think about it. Are they set in stone where they go from when they're built? Like when the game generates them? Or does it decide when you enter them for the first time? Because I do want that wormhole to go there. I just didn't... Hmm. 
I just don't want to go there yet. I guess we'll find out. Let's go in there again. Let's go in there again. It's time to find out. Yeah, let's just go in there again. And if it's Grox, I'll be like, mm, no thanks. <laughs> I'll just go right back out. <laughs> be like, nope, I didn't see anything. The room on the opposite end is the same name as the as it was before, so... Nah, this is looking promising. Yeah, this is the same thing. I can tell. Okay, um... Just in case that triggered something... We're just gonna not even go through. <laughs> okay. Just... I just wanna be super safe. Okay, so that, now that we know that's where that goes, we can just... We can just goof around in our... Uh, general, the general vicinity of our starting area. And see what, who we can meet, and see if we can meet other empires, and do more adventures, things like that. So I'm pretty sure there are more empires this way. Pretty sure there would be. Let's explore some of these planets while we're at it. Treasure! Freeman? Planet Freeman? Morgan Freeman. I know it's not spelled the same, but still. Um, I think the sound is glitched. The sound is glitched, and I'm not seeing the treasure. Hold on. Okay, the game is very much glitching right now. Um, yeah, great. Morgan Freeman didn't want me on his planet. <laughs> um. Um. Hello. Did everything lock? Everything locked up. Whoa! Oh my God! What the heck? Everything locked up, not just Spore. Well, this is... This is not working out. Well, whatever. There's a treasure, yeah. Yay, we got a treasure hunter badge. We got a bigger cargo hold. Okay, for my home world. Alien ships are planet are attacking my home planet. Who would dare attack my frickin' home planet? No, no, is it just pirates? Cause like, dude, we have turrets up the wazoo in my home world. The curse of the Grox! It's frickin' pirates. They're attacking my home world. They must want to die. Was that it? That was it. You're welcome. It wasn't that hard. I'll take this one spice. Thanks. Pretty ambitious attacker. Yep. <laughs> All right, I guess we'll... Is it time to collect more spice? I think it's time to collect more spice. Uh... I think we're at a slightly different angle than we were before. That throws me off. I don't know about anybody else if, who plays this game, but if I rotate the camera at all while I'm in space stage, I will get lost. Because I'm used to everything being in a certain space based on... Ba based on how it's looking. From like that, was from the first point of view you're at by default. If that makes any sense at all, because the camera was slightly rotated, like I, I was slightly thrown off. Like yeah, I feel like this is how it was, something like this. Oh no no no. Yeah, like this, I think. Yeah. Did you know that Doctor Who came before Star Trek, which came before Star Wars? No, I didn't know that necessarily. I didn't. I didn't know that. I knew Star Trek was before Star Wars. 
I, I didn't know when Doctor Who was released because I know almost nothing about it. How curt is the pirates to provide them by dying? <laughs> Can we want to buy red? 3,000 for red? I guess that's all right. I feel like I could do better, but red's not that not red's not that good anyway. You really qualmed up an inzerg. All right, um, let's buy some things. You guys want to sell us anything fun? All right, uh, you guys sell lasers. I don't want to buy lasers though. You guys don't sell crap. You guys are freaking traitors. You guys are supposed to sell lots of stuff, aren't you? Um, these two guys are building dangerously close to each other. I really hope they like each other, because if they start fighting each other, they're going to ask me to pick a side. <laughs> Which sucks when that happens. Hey, buy a purple spice. Thanks. Um, I'll hey, you guys buy a better cargo hold. Thanks. I already have some colony packs. I don't need more. I guess that's all I get from you. 963, 3, 66, Star is 77, okay. Ian, I'm here just reliable aliens, even if they ain't selling much. <laughs> yes. Hey, they're expanding their empire over here. Do you guys sell anything fun? I forgot. What might an ecologist sell? Uh, uh, crap. You guys sell crap. This is what happens when nature people go to space with technology. And we're locked up again. Yeah, some